All right, y'all, this is Broken Ladder Sports Gaming, and this is our season playthrough, Backyard Baseball 2003, extra difficult mode. Let's get right into it. So I recently discovered this mod for the game where you can make it really, really hard. And that's what we're gonna do. Hard mode, no swing spot, no pitch locator, six innings, errors on, Dubois Diamond. So basically, all the computer players have huge boosts and the AI is super aggressive. You'll see when we play. Let's pick our team. We're gonna start with Keisha. She's gonna be playing left field. She's gonna be batting lead off. Her defense is good in left field. She's tall, she's got a good arm, she's got good speed. Next is gonna be Pete Wheeler. He's gonna bat second and he's gonna play second base. We're kind of hiding his defense, but we're using his speed. Next is gonna be Ahmed Khan. Possibly the best hitter in the game. We're gonna stick him at first because he can't really play defense and he's not fast. He can't throw it either, but you need his bat in the lineup. Speaking of bats you need in the lineup, Pablo, the GOAT, secret weapon. He'll be playing right field, also to hide his defense. Very offensive lineup. Here's the defensive player you need, Derek Jeter, best in the game. He's gonna be playing shortstop. Barry's gonna be playing catcher, actually. You'll see why when we start playing, but he's gonna be batting sixth and playing catcher. Next, we're gonna have Ken Griffey. He's gonna be playing center field. He's got a great glove. Not great speed, but an elite bat, 100 power. Lefty bat, you just need him in your lineup. We're gonna be batting him seventh. Batting eighth is gonna be Mikey Thomas, not playing catcher, actually playing third for us because of his arm strength. He's also got a great bat, another lefty. And pitching is going to be Angela Del Vecchio. She's also got a pretty decent bat, 89 power, and she's a really good pitcher. So that's the team. You'll be able to tell fairly early on that this is not the normal hard difficulty. When we get into the teams, the computer should have crazy high boosts. Let's turn off color commentary, play by play, player talking, and chatter. Chatter is awful. I don't know why people play with it. So here's our team. We're gonna get everybody in the right positions. One thing you'll notice about this is that we never get any boosts or decreases. I think I've seen one time a very small boost for one of my players on this difficulty. But for the most part, they're just playing straight up, which is actually kind of nice. So that's our team, our lineup. That's how everyone's gonna be laid out. Let's get into our opponent's roster. All right, we got the Wombats. As you can already tell, this is not normal gameplay. Esmeralda can't run, let's remember that. Nate can't bat, let's remember that. Fielding bat, third base, but everything else, pretty juiced. Pretty, pretty juiced, yeah. I mean, you can already tell, and they got that extra 11 running, which makes them just crazy fast. The fielding, they can throw the ball so hard. They hit it so hard. Either way, we gotta get started. So Red Wombats, Arizona Diamondbacks, game one of the season, Dubois Diamond, home opener. Let's go, baby. First pitch of the season is a left hook high and in, just clips the zone, absolutely beautiful stuff from Angela. Paint, absolute paint. Down and away, Angela with a slow ball to get her first strikeout of the season. Three pitches and a strikeout. A third of the way to an immaculate inning. That's a great start for us. Another brilliant pitch. Four pitches, four strikes. Cruising. Oh dear. Oh God. Billy Jean. Holy crap. Well, that just goes to show you. That's what we're dealing with here. Takes a pitch high and inside and sends it into orbit. 376. I, that went a lot higher than it did far, but damn, that is crazy. All right. 1-0. <laughs> if Angela can get her shit together. And a swing and a miss. Slow ball down and away. Angela gets her second strike out of the game. That's nine pitches, two Ks. We got Ruth Prout coming to the plate. Just elite tier stuff there from Angela. Four batters come up, one homers, but three strike out. She ends up striking out the side. Wombats are up one nothing on one hit. Got the top of the lineup coming up, let's get it. 
Keisha is our leadoff batter. Let's see if she can get on base. Hopefully get some extra base power. Swings at the first pitch. That's a grounder to short. Actually, the pitcher's going to pick it up. Toss it to first for the first out. First ball in play for the season. A little dribbler. Oh, that was right down the middle of the plate. Pete slaps it. A rebound. Two players run into each other. Bounces off them. But the second baseman actually tracks back and catches that off the rebound. Ooh, a strike at the very bottom of the zone. Three balls, two strikes, two outs. Gotta go. Oh, Ahmed kills that. Get gone. Get gone, baby. That is a tractor shot. Dead center field. Ahmed, first homer of the season. Sits at 242. All right, the goat's up. We got a 1-1 game. We're right back in this, folks. Right back in it. Oh, that was tasty, too. That was a tasty pitch. Pablo probably should have closed his stance there, but he pops it up to the catcher, who fumbles it, but the pitcher is there to make the catch. All right. A home run apiece going into the top of the second. 1-1. One, one. Donald Vogel, I don't remember him having a decrease, so we got to be careful again. A grounder. Angela goes to pick it up. Throws it to first. Not there in time. Super speed for Vogel gets him on base. We got a runner at first. No outs. And another strike. Stealing. Stealing second. Didn't work that time. Barry missed the throw completely. I don't think he would have gotten him anyway. Liner. Right up the middle. Ken's going to pick it up. They've got a run scoring opportunity. Pete throws it home. Not in time. 2-1. Can we get it to second in time? We can. And the out at second. That's our first out, but they take a lead. 2-1 to one Wombats. And a perfect, perfect right hook. Down and away. Gets Jordan Thorner. Nothing you can do about that. Spitball right down the middle is absolutely pissed on. But it goes foul. Wow, what a relief. I don't know about throwing a, a spitball right down the middle. I don't know about that. Strike three. Angela is cooking right now. It's five strikeouts on the day. Doing work. We give up another run, but we're looking pretty good right now. Eric, Barry, and Ken coming up. Closes the stance, or squares it rather. Sends one to left field. It's deep. He fumbles it. We're going a second. Oh my god, what a throw. Get to first. It's out of play. We'll take our base. That sound you hear when they throw it, I don't know if I've ever heard that with any normal backyard player before. They throw it so, so hard. But we got a runner at third and no outs. Barry's up. That was tasty. High and away. Barry takes it. But they catch it in right field. A very, very, very nice play. Garrett gets back to third. The fence keeps the ball in. Almost threw it out of bounds there and had a free run. Ken saw something he liked, but he pops it up to the first baseman. It's gonna stay fair. It's gonna be the second out. Mikey Tater's coming up. First at bat of the season. Let's see if we can get Derek home from third. A little pop-up right to the pitcher. She's going to catch it. That's three outs. We get a hit, but we leave a runner at third. I think I remember Esmeralda not being able to run. Maybe we can take advantage of that. Liner on the ground. Pete picks it up. Throws it to first. She wasn't very fast. All right, let's remember that. Esmeralda is slow, and Nate can't hit. We could get a quick two outs here if we're careful. This time we go spitball away, but he bunts it. Barry picks it up, throws it to first. That's why you put Barry at catcher. That's enough to pick up the bunt. You can throw it hard enough to get him out at first. Hopefully that'll be really good this season. Hopefully that'll work for us all year. Spanks one, right to Ken. Throws it to Pete, can't get it there in time. Still throws it to first. 
Throws it to second. Can't get it. That's a double for Billy Jean Blackwood. Sent it right up the middle. Probably should have just put that in our pocket and not thrown it to first. But alas. Two outs. Man at second. Swings it. Probably a ball. Angela's going to pick that up. Somebody's going to pick it up. Throw it to first. Isn't in time. It is. Very, very nice. Way to get out of the inning. We put up a zero in the third inning. All right, Angela can get a hold of one. If she does, it's definitely gone, but she can't run, so that's kind of the only way. Crushes one foul. Absolutely crushes that, but foul left. Oh, that was great. Angela crushes it to left field. Is it going to be enough? On the warning track. It does not get out. The center fielder comes over to make the catch. Why is the center fielder there? Why is not the left fielder making that catch? Not sure. Right down the middle. He just spanks it to left center. Wow, the shortstop sprints back and makes the catch. That's what it's going to be like. This might be a long season. If they can just throw it right down the middle and we can't hit home runs or get on base, it's going to be tough. Flaps it, foul, liner from Pete, just foul. I could have been a double. Ooh, that's tasty. Another liner, right to the third baseman. Pete is gonna get to first despite an absurd throw from left field. Almost the rare 7-3 put out there. You don't see that a lot. Ahmed's got a home run already today. Let's see if he can get another. Maybe we can get the lead. Oh, that was too bad of a pitch. You can't throw that to Ahmed. That's gone. Home run number two on the day. Beautiful. Ooh, a pig shot. Hit the pigs. They're oinking. 317. Beautiful stuff from Ahmed. He's the MVP of this game so far. Uh-oh. Ooh, just foul. We're a little early on that one, but that was right down the middle. Another pitch that is way, way, way too crushable. Is that gonna go? It just will right over the hay bales in right field. Pablo slaps one. Absolute crusher. 322 on the distance. We've got a 4-2 lead. All right, Derek got stranded at third his first at bat. Let's see if we can get him on base and get him home. He liked that one, but it was low. That low pitch right beneath the zone is a kryptonite for me. I swing that way too often. And that's right down the middle. But it's a slow, slow dribbler to first. Can we get there in time? They fumble the bag at first. The pitcher cannot field it. Derek gets to first on a cheesy, cheesy single. Barry's up. Man at first. Two outs. Another one right down the middle. He fouls it back, but Tina is just throwing absolute meat right now. That's a slow one. Oh, another foul ball. I don't know how Barry's fouling these are. Another one. And he pops it up. Probably going to make that catch. And that'll be the third out. Wow, that was three pitches right down the middle in a row. We couldn't connect. All right, Angela's twirling a gem. Let's see if she can keep it going. Bouncer, right to Angela. She picks it up, but she dives. Throws it to first way too late. Ahmed throws it to second, and we get the out. Trying to stretch a single into a double. They get thrown out at second. There is one out. Pop up. Little pop up of Derek. He fumbles it. They throw it to first and they go to second again, but he's going to make it this time for sure. That is a cheesy, cheesy double. Liner, crushed, right to Derek. Throws it to second for the double play. Very, very nice. We'll get a power up for that. Let's see what it is. That was a huge double play. Huge double play there. Prevents a run almost certainly. And it's the screaming line drive. We will not use it yet. Uh-oh. Ooh, another foul ball. Tina is just throwing outside meat right now. Just meatballs right on the outside corner. Bouncer, right up the first baseline. They pick it up. 
Throw it to first, but another error by the first baseman, and Ken is safe at first. What is going on? We don't really have speed on the base pass, so I don't see the screaming line drive happening right now. We're going to stay with power. Yet another one right down the middle, but it's too low. They're going to get Mikey at first, and Ken is going to get out at second. They have a double play of their own. Still no screaming line drive. No reason to use it now. A bouncer. Angela, I don't know why you're swinging at that. First baseman does not fumble that one. We don't put up any runs. They get the three outs. We got Jordan, Butch, and Esmeralda coming up. Bottom of the order. Right on the outside corner. Bounces it to Mikey. Can he get it to first in time? Even with that 100 throw power, it just isn't enough. Beats out a routine grounder. Uh-oh. That is crushed. That is back. I don't think Ken's going to be able to get that. Home run. Tough. High ball game. Really nice pitch on the outside corner and just sent it to right center field like it was nothing. Like it was nothing. Angela uses the juice. Perfect pitch. Slow ball down and in. Angela cannot be stopped. She's held them to four runs, which is a very low total for this difficulty. He's doing big things right now. We got Nate coming up. 0 for 2 with a strikeout on the day. Get him out. Liner to Mikey on the ground. Not going to get there in time, but he's going to second. Can we get him out at second? No, we cannot. Billy Jean Slugger's coming up. Kind of worried about this one. And we shouldn't be. He grounds it to Pete. Can we get the out at first? We cannot. We throw it home to get the out at home. We can't get the out at home. Can we throw it to third to get the out at third? We cannot. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. A triple for Billie Jean Blackwood. An RBI triple. My voice cracked a little bit. Opens up the stance. Weak grounded to Mikey. We go home to get the out. Very nice play by Mikey. Heads up play. Love that. That's a grounder. That's right to Pete. Going to second for the easy out. Ends the inning. We got a one-run deficit. Top of the order coming up. Get some runs. All right, bottom of the fifth. Keisha's yet to get a hit. I hope that changes right here. We're going to stay with line drive. We're not going to use the power-up yet. Pitch down and away. She lines it to left field. But right to the left fielder. One out. Pete's speed has been an asset today, but we need to abuse that a little bit more. Screaming line drive. Perfect, perfect person to use it. Slams it to right field. Let's see if we can get to second. No way. No way, man. Slide. Very nice. All right. Pete slaps out a single to right field. With the screaming line drive and can't get any more. But Ahmed's got two home runs on the day. And he make it 3-4-3 three, three and take the lead. That would be beautiful. Got a little too greedy with that one. I, I think Pete can get to second. He can. Can Ahmed get to first? He cannot. Okay, we got a runner at second. Two outs. Bottom of the fifth. We're down by one. But we've got the GOAT coming up. He's already got a home run on the day. If he can get another, we're in a really good spot. No need to swing at that. That's a ball outside. Don't throw it outside to Pablo, though. Don't do that. Wow, that's a really good pitch. Uh-oh. Right out to center field on a line. Center fielder cannot make the catch. Pete's going to go for home. That's a really hard throw, but they have to come out to get it. The game is tied. Pablo with an RBI single. Really good stuff there from Pablo. The center fielder commits an error, cannot make the catch. You got Derek coming up with two outs. Tie game. Liner, right field. Caught. Tie ball game. Five runs apiece, nine hits apiece. I don't know about that. 
Okay, to Mikey again. Can he make the play this time? Throws it to first on a line. Not in time. The throw to second is also not in time. Lead off double. Uh-oh. Swings at it. Shouldn't have swung at it. Angel's going to pick that up. Throw it to first. The play at home isn't in time. Not in time. Ahmed could not get the ball out of his glove there. He does not throw it to home in time. In the top of the six, the Wombats take a one-run lead. We need to get these next two outs. Hop up. Third baseline. Who's going to get it? Two players going for it. Who's going to get it? Nobody's going to get it. Barry throws it to second. Not in time. That is a bummer. Butch already has a homer on the day. This is dangerous, folks. This is very dangerous. Now oh, we got to go slow ball. Bouncer. Right in front. Angela, can she make the play? No, she's going to throw it to first and get the out. But not the out at home. That's two runs they've gotten the exact same way in this inning. They take a two-run lead in the top of the sixth. Oh, dear. Esmeralda pisses on one. Oh, dear. That's not good at all. She can't run. She can hit, but she can't run. I must have forgotten that. That's 433. Right to left field. This is the guy that can't hit. Another strike. Okay. Two strikes. Two outs. We need this right here. And we get it. All right. Down and in with the slow ball. Just clips the zone. Nate strikes out. We've got ourselves a bit of a hole here. Three runs down going into the bottom of the sixth inning. Middle of the order. Middle bottom coming up. We need runs here. We need Barry to get on base. We can't really sacrifice outs for runs here. We need to get people on base and we need them to score. They finally pull Tina. Put Esmeralda in. New pitcher. I don't know why Barry swung at that. That was way out of the zone. A much more hittable pitch, but he fouls it off. Barry has been fouling off some really easy pitches today. Strike three. Swings at a ball below the zone. Barry having a tough day at the plate today. Ken comes up. Down three runs. One out. Starting to need a little bit of a miracle here. That is another foul ball. That's an outside high pitch. Ken loves that pitch. Fouls it off. There it is. That's the one. That's a moonshot. Can't throw that outside high pitch to Ken. Can't throw it once. Certainly can't throw it twice. Into the pool. Let's go. The piggy trough. 233. We're coming back a little bit. A little bit. Mikey up. Two down. One out. Need some more luck here. Need some more magic. Had to swing at a spitball. Any power up you gotta swing at. Should have moved it outside the middle of the zone. That was too tasty. Mikey delivers. Hits one to right field. Will it get on top of the building? It will. That is back to back homers. Is it? Yes, it is. Back to back homers. Bottom of the sixth inning. We got something happening here, folks. One out, one down. Okay. Angela has been pitching a great game so far. She's over two at the plate. There's one out. She can hit a dinger. We're in a really good spot here. That was crushable. She fouled it off. Very crushable pitch. Two strikes. Another crushable pitch. And another foul ball from Angela. Don't do that. Don't do that. The liner out to center field. Hopefully he drops it. He does. Angela. Excuse me. Angela is going to get to first. All right. We got man on first. One out. One down. Keisha, we need some power from you. We're probably going to need to go to power stance here. Yes, we will. Okay. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Just a weak little pop-up. Get back to the base. Oh, no. Oh, that's the game. Oh, man. Well, I thought that was going to go differently, and it did not. Check these stats. Wow, that's really deflating. I thought we had something going there. Same number of hits. We get one fewer run. 
Angela takes the first loss of the season on a really good performance, honestly. She was really good today. Who showed up? Ahmed definitely showed up. Ken had a clutch homer. Mikey had a clutch homer. Angela tried to keep it going in the bottom of the six, but could not get it done. Yeah, Ahmed right now is cruising. Probably the MVP so far. What are we hitting? What are we slugging? We're hitting 428. We're slugging 103. We want to have the average above 500 and the slugging above one. See if we can do that throughout the season. But other than that, we lose the first game by one run. Tough double play to end it there. Seven to eight. Started the comeback, but could not complete it. We lose at home. 0 and 1 on the season. But anyway, that'll be the first episode. Like and subscribe if you've been a fan of the video. I'll see you later.